actor is the first thing that I remember wanting to do in life. Um, I remember at 14, 15 years old, watching some classic films, not, well, spending months and months watching all the great classics, all the great performers of the past, and being so incredibly inspired by them and saying to myself, one day I want to come close to doing something that good. So th I think that that thirst or that drive to just achieve what I believe is something as good as, you know, those heroes that I have is what continues to make me want to, uh, want to do this. Sort of on a tirade trying to promote this film because I just want to see more films like this out there as a fan of movies. But as far as awards are concerned, you know, the truth is there's a lot of peace of mind in it because you really realize that you ultimately have no control of these things. Right. Like I said, uh, I, you know, honestly, I, I do these movies because I really love, love movies and I want to make great movies. You know, and, and I think that is fundamentally truly important for, for an actor to be able to, like I, like I was talking earlier, to, to suspend that disbelief. If you know way too many things intimately about a, a specific human being, they're not able to convey those characters realistically to an audience. You, you feel like, oh, that's not him, he's just acting. Yeah. Or that he, they're nothing like that. And so, uh, yes, I, I, I feel like I, when there is specific material that I feel deserves uh, this type of forum, I, I, I do seize those moments, so you're right. What gives me strength all the time is to be able to have formulated a group of people around me that are my friends and my family. You know, those two words are enmeshed in my opinion, but it's given me a, a, a grounding that as, as insane as my life can be sometimes is always refreshing and they're always so honest with me and I'm so thankful Everything at the end of the day when you're making a movie starts with the material and, and, and how well written the script is. I've never seen a silk purse made from a sow's ear. Yes. I've never seen it happen wherein a crap script with crap characters, a director somehow found a way to make a masterpiece out of it. And that's the constant struggle that we all sort of have as actors is finding those gems and that's why people grab onto them like vultures. When, when you find a great piece of material or a great script, it's like, you should see what happens, it's like a piranha feeding fest. <laughs> <laughs>